Hello everyone, my name is Teo Salvador, welcome back to another episode of Workers and Resources Soviet Republic. We are here, outside of our steel plant. Stalingrad is right there, Pluto-Grad's in the distance, Nera Pepe is over there, our new town is right there behind this mountain. Man, we have an action-packed episode today. Actually, no we don't, I don't know, do we? Maybe we do. If you missed the last couple episodes, we are working here in Daisy Monum. We are here building our new university, if you missed the last couple episodes. If you missed last episode, um, we are doing some refining to our towns, um, adding, uh, what do you say, what do you, uh, walk, uh, English is hard, I'm sorry. Uh, we are adding walking paths, uh, sidewalks, I don't know, would you call those sidewalks? I don't think those are sidewalks. You would consider sidewalks to be along the edge of the road. No, these would be like walking paths, right? Trails? I don't know. We're just going to call them walking paths, because I feel like that makes the most sense. So anyways, in the previous episode, we were spending it building walking paths, um, trying to get the town more connected with society. Um, and yeah, we're working slowly. I think something we might do is we might actually... We're going to continue that in this episode. Um, while the construction companies work on the, um, the, the wonderful university that's being built in Daisy Monum. Um, let's see. How, how is everybody doing, by the way? Everybody seems to be going well. What are you doing? Why are you home? Uh, I don't know. Where, where are they actually on this? Um, concrete. Okay. Asphalt needs to be delivered. And they can start working on this. Why aren't they building... Oh, okay. You know what? This is preferable. Um, so, in my other save, the excavators travel by themselves all the way from, like, the other side of the map. And they travel at, like, two miles an hour down the freeway. And it takes them, like, 30 years just to get to the construction site. So, it's great to see that, um... In this save, the excavators are actually being transported by real trucks, um, such as these two right here. Oh, look at that. It's like a little convoy. There we go. Um, okay, so let's get on with this episode. We're going to continue this episode with refining our towns, um, building walking paths and things like that. That's what we're going to do this episode. And of course, my nose starts running right as I start recording the video. It's just traditional. Um, we're going to demolish some houses. Yes, that's what we're going to do, because I want to connect this. Um, there we go. Demolish that. Uh, okay. Let's plop that there. Look at that. It looks like it was meant to be. Can you get out of the way? Get out of the way. Okay, thank you. Uh, all right. Now, what does this do for us? Ooh, it doesn't do anything extra. Okay. See, the reason I did this was because I wanted to connect this apartment complex. But it doesn't seem that the apartment complex can reach this. But that's okay. They have buses. The buses should be able to do them just fine. Um, why do we lack the power of electricity? We lack the ability to make electricity because we lack coal. Question is, why do we lack coal? We lack coal... Missing coal. Lies. Why are you... It's a lie. It's lies. It, it's literally a lie. You're making me buy you coal because... Okay, fine. It's this guy. Is it the brick factory? The brick factory is stealing all the coal. It's not sending resources. Operating without issues. There we go. See, you're having... Yeah, you're you're, you're just having a wonderful time. Oh, uh, gosh. Why, why, why do you guys like to not function? Okay. By the way, did I talk about the update that just came out like two weeks ago? Um, they added a new building. If we go to state infrastructure, they added a thing called secret police. Um, yeah. So basically what they added in the game is government loyalty. And the secret police building basically gives you information on the government loyalty. It doesn't actually do anything. Um, it, yeah, it doesn't really do anything, unfortunately. It's, it's not like, um, you know you can replace people who have low loyalty. Um, but if we go into the game settings, crime and justice. Look at this. This is a new thing. Um, and it's not currently in the game yet, but I am interested to see how that plays out. Crime and justice. Man, this game is difficult, right? Like, man, imagine what crime and justice... What, what would crime and justice be in this type of society? I don't know. It's interesting. Because technically in this game, there's no currency among the people, right? I don't know. There's, yeah. I, I, I would imagine that it would probably be cheating out on rations and stuff like that. I don't, I don't really know. Anyways. So, yes. Uh, that, that's how we're playing out. Uh, it would be really cool as if I could... I guess. No, I was going to say it would be nice if I could connect this. But I can't. I can't. 
I can't make a little walk path across that. That's a shame. Um, okay, then. That's, that's, that's perfectly fine, then. Perfectly normal. Uh, okay. Let's go over to, uh, Nera Pepe. I touched Nera, uh, um, excuse me. What was I gonna say? I, uh, I briefly touched up Nera Pepe in the previous episode, and we didn't, we didn't really do much, though. Uh, we kind of just took a look, um, and it looks like they're working just fine. We got a good amount of meat being produced. It is gonna be winter soon. Um, they have a good amount of food going. Um, that's a problem. Why, why we lack the, why, why do we lack the beautiful electricity? Do you lack electricity because the West is taking it all? <laughs> Fine. Do you, is that why you lack electricity? Because the Western people are taking it all? Alright, fine. You know what? I will buy some coal with Western dollars. Now, please. Please, don't let the West take all of our electricity. Uh, is, is, that, is that what's going on here? Yeah, I think that's what's going on here. The West was stealing all of our electricity, which is costing us... Money. Well, it's not really costing us money. It's just costing us. It's it's causing problems because people aren't producing. Okay. Um, where should I bring this? Should I extend this road? Maybe I don't know. Let's see, I could extend this this way. Oh, excuse me. Gosh, everything goes wrong when I start recording. Like I had a stuffy nose, and then suddenly I have like a. Uh, what is it? I, I have a, a... My throat goes dry. It's like everything everything bad happens when I start recording. I hit the record button and success is like, all right, I'm going to head out. <laughs> that's that's what happens. Okay, Nera Pepe I think is okay. If we look at this place, they actually, they're actually doing pretty good. Um, now, do we have meat? Meat is doing okay. How are you guys doing? You guys are doing good. Um, is this my frozen place? That's the grain train. Oh, yeah. We're going to set up some more farms uh, coming next spring. Um, right now, it's late winter, so we're going to... We, yeah, we... Uh, yeah, yeah, nah. It's... I don't even know what any of that was. That wasn't... I don't think that was English. Um, yeah, it, it, it's, it's, it's October, so they're not going to be able to do anything. Um, as of right now, I think we can put our resources towards more important things. I mean, because as of right now, if you look at this, right? Look at the amount of food they have left and the amount of alcohol... Excuse me. Um... The amount of food they have in here. They got a pretty good amount of food, and they're, they're still producing. Look at that. So, um, even with our little grain distillery over here, um, or grain distillery, our alcohol distillery, they're still doing pretty good with that. Um, so, you know, it's nothing to panic about. What is this? Oh, construction office. Oh, I built a construction office right there? Oh, I built a construction office right there, and I never did anything with it. Wow, okay. God, I don't know why, but my voice feels really heavy. Oh, <clears throat> It's fine. It's okay. I'll, I'll make it. Um, okay, so yeah, yeah, good. Everything, everything's fine and dandy. I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna take a road, um, and we're gonna take the road out this way, and we're gonna take the road that. There we go. Uh, I'll bring it like that. Connect the road this way, and I guess we won't do that. Nope. Can I? I mean, that yeah. Okay, that works. You know what? That's fine. You want to you wanna build it like that? That works. That's fine. I'll, I'll, I'll go with it. Um, what is this actually going to do for us? Oh, wow. Look at that. The nice thing about this town is they have connections to pretty much everywhere, regardless to our paths. Citizen loyalty is low. Lies. That's a lie. Um, actually, how do we know that, though? Because technically we don't have secret police going on here. Okay. Coal is missing. Everything is going wrong. What is wrong with our coal facility? Can we... Can I just buy a bunch of coal ore? Like, let's just say I was to buy a bunch of this. Right? And you start producing mass amounts of coal. How about I, how about I give you a jump start? It's $16,000. That's okay. I'll go with it. We give it like a little jump start. And then it'll at least help them a little bit. Um, actually. Excuse me. Man, that is a shame. Why, why is that no connected? Why, why you no connect? A building's in the way? That's a lie. Lies buildings being in the way don't exist there we go so now that should help out a little bit because the issue is um they're having trouble wanting to go here right because they get to the bus station and they're like oh wait i can also go here but they can't because it's not connected so they don't think about going here so hopefully with this little path we have here they should they might want to travel down there and figure out what work they can get a little more um, something to think about in the future is the automobile industry. Um, I've been playing with the automobile industry in my other save, and I have to say something. I'm gonna buy this car real quick, because I just want to show it to you. Um, this car here, 
It's a, it's a real car, and I have to say, it, it's such a cute little car. Where is it? It's uh, the Trabi, it's the Trabant 601 from East Germany. Look at how little that car is. And it's a real car in real life, and it's just as small. And, I, man, I love it. I love it. I want one. I want one. It, yeah, I really do. <laughs> yeah, it, 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 it's such a cool little car, and I, I was looking at YouTube videos of, like, people driving it. I don't know, it, it's, it looks cool. Unfortunately, they don't sell them in the United States. Um, and if they do, they're extremely rare. Because the one video I watched, it was a guy who owned one in the United States. Uh, but I, I imagine he probably bought it in Europe and had it imported, so... You know, it's probably a little expensive. Um, yeah. Anyways. So yeah. A little tiny car. If you play Jalopy, you actually drive a Trabant 601. Um, which I think is kind of cool. Uh, okay, so what are we doing? We are here in Palutograd. We don't need to be in Palutograd. I was here talking about it, I, about a car. Stalin, uh, Stalingrad. Stalingrad is doing good. Um, Baharad is doing good. Um, Daisy Monum is holding on. They're, 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 yeah, they're holding on. Where is the shop? The shop is right there. Why would we ever place the shop there? Like, out of all the places we could place a shop down, we place it right there. Wow, good going, Mateo. You're, you're, you're so successful. Actually, eh, the shop isn't that great. Okay. I was hoping the shop would go further, but it, yeah, it really doesn't. Yeah, okay. Um, then I guess what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to make some roads. Uh, you know what would be nice is if I could connect that. Okay. You know what? We'll deal with Daisy Monum later. Look at this. Our, our construction companies are working away. They're delivering the concrete. Um, are they working yet? Uh, we should have our excavators, right? Yeah, there we go. Our excavators are here. They are working. They are functioning. They're doing their thing. They're slowly building the university. Um, look at the money we have in rubles. Um, yeah, these things, these buildings here are super expensive. Um, nice thing about having the construction company. You don't actually have to worry about any of that. It, you know, you use your own resources and it's super cheap. Okay, oil especi. Let's deal with oil especi. Um, and then I think we'll deal with Daisy Monum last. Because they're still kind of constructing it and I don't want to put things in the way. Um, where is the shop? The shop is right here. The shop can get to multiple places. Um, but they can't get everywhere. Why are you without power? Lies. It's a lie. You have electricity. Shut up. You have, you have the electricity. Okay, move you there. We're demolishing buildings for the greater good. Because we need to build paths. Because these people over here get a little unhappy with us. They're a little unhappy with the fact that, um, there's nothing close to them. And the thing about building these paths as well is the fact uh, that we can, um... Ooh, where did I go? Where am I? What, did, what happened? Where, oh, wait. Okay, sorry, I... Okay, that's, yeah. Sorry, I, you know what would be nice is if that path was over here, but it's not. It's not, so we're gonna have to make it over there. Um, how about we do something like this? There we go. We could always add, like, a little monument right there, too, um, which will help with things. Monuments um, do help with their loyalty to the government. Um, although I'm not too sure exactly what happens with their loyalty. I think if it's loyal, um, with their loyalty. So, with loyalty, if the more loyal they are towards the government, the more they really don't care about problems. Um, so, all these problems, you know, they, 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 they'll ignore them. They'll kind of just turn a blind eye and won't really care, which is, I guess, a good thing. Okay, um, can I ex continue this path? Ooh. Okay, I guess... I, I guess that's what we're doing. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm, I'm gonna remake this path. I'm sorry, I, I don't like it. I'm gonna demolish these two buildings. Goodbye, nobody even lives there. Makes my job easy, makes my job easy. See, because when nobody lives in buildings, it makes my job easy, because who cares if I destroy them? Nobody lives there, it's not helping anything. You know, it was like the building already wasn't there, but it was. We just made it not there, more not there. I don't know, that didn't make sense. Uh, okay. Let's connect that there. It'll be really cool. Um, does that have... That has nobody living in it. None of these buildings have anybody living in them because of the fact that they can't get anywhere. Even though we have a bus right here. And the bus is taking them to places. Residential food line. Oh, that's a... That's a, an ambulance. There you go. Uh, okay. Let's take that that way. Let's take that that way. And let's plop it that way. There we go. So hopefully some of these buildings that do have people living in them, even though that's literally no building around here, um, can at least find a little more happiness uh, with their lives. Okay, a little expensive doing that, but that's okay. Uh, there we go. Buy the Americans out. There we go. 
Okay, now where can you go? You can't... Yeah, okay. Why? Okay. I was hoping you'd be able to go further, but you can't do that. Okay, fair enough. What about you? You can't go any further either. Oh, I hate paths in this game. It's like, why? I just, I just, I want this building to be able to walk all the way over here. Like, if you're telling me you can't walk from here, go here, go here, go here, and then there. Like, uh. Oh, you know what it might be? It might be the fact of this. The fact that there's a house in the way. I thought this path was connected to this building. Lies, it seems. That's why, that's why they're not connected here, I think. Although, yeah, I don't know. Anyways, hopefully everybody's having a good week. It is Wednesday. Um, I might be live a little bit later. Um, I've been looking at Mafia, the game Mafia. Um, and the reason I'm looking at the game Mafia is because I heard about GTA Trilogy. Um, I guarantee everybody here is, well, I don't know. GTA Trilogy hasn't really been on my radar, if I'm honest. Um, it's kind of just been one of those games that like I heard about, but I didn't really care much about. And funny thing is, I was talking about it on a Discord, uh, one of my Discord servers that I'm on, and they were all hyped about it and stuff like that, and I was, I was talking to them, and I'm like, do we really have hope for the game? And um, I was like, well, you know, may, you know maybe it's going to be good. Um, obviously, it hasn't been on my radar, so I haven't really been focusing on it too much. Um, and then the game released, and I, heard, I, I hear that a lot of people aren't happy with it. Um, so I'm kind of curious if anybody has played it. You know, what, what are your guys' thoughts on the game? Um, I probably won't play it. If I do, it'll be on, uh, tw um, if I do, it'll be on Twitch, but I doubt I'm gonna pay for it. 60 bucks. The game is 60 bucks, and, um, yeah, I kinda just don't think it's, it's not really up my alley, I think. Um, I mean, I, I did play GTA 5, but I've never finished the storyline. Um, I did play GTA San Andreas, the original one. I did do that. That game definitely does have, is good, but I don't know. Okay, um, how, how is life going? Um, car. Can the car that's zooming about outside just be quiet while I'm recording? Ah, <sighs> dang traffic jams. I love this. This is just great. It's just great. You know what would be nice is if I could tell them to go somewhere. Why can't I tell them to go to the gas station? Like, why, you know, because look at this. You run into issues where you have traffic. Aw, oh, stupid traffic jams. Okay, fine, fair enough. Because you have the issue. Oh, I didn't want to do that. Dang it, game. Okay, uh, where, where's the building I need to put it to? That one? There we go. Perfect. Okay. Cancel, go to depot. What I wanted to do is I wanted you to discard all your cargo. How are you doing? You, you need to discard all your cargo. You need to, to remove all your cargo as well. Goodbye. Uh, where are you going? You are going to the quarry, I think. Or you're going to go get fuel. You are turning around. You're doing a U-turn. Okay, why don't you just do a U-turn? I don't know, whatever doesn't matter. All right, there we go. Our gravel plants are working. How are you doing? You're doing good on fuel. You're doing good on fuel. Everything seems to be going pretty well right now. Um, except for the fact that this huge path we made isn't doing anything to anybody. <coughs> what was this? New vehicle type available. Train. Ooh, I, I don't use the trains very much. Um, okay, how long have I been recording? Okay, I've only been recording for like 15 minutes, so we're going to go for like another 5 minutes. Um, what else should we do with this town? I don't know. We have Mozzie Canum and Daisy Monum. Uh, I think we're going to focus on those towns in the next episode. Um, but as of right now, um, what, is, what are people so unhappy about? I'm guessing these people are probably unhappy with sports. They're, not, they're unhappy with culture. They can't see the great culture. Um, okay, fair enough. Uh, I guess we'll go and we'll add some sports and stuff like that. I think that's in residential. Yep. Um, we'll add, uh, that. There we go. Required temperature, 5 degrees Celsius. Ooh, interesting. I didn't know that. Okay, are you happy now with this? You should be happy, and if you're not happy, then I don't know how to make you happy. Um, mods. Let's see. Do I have any monuments that we can add? Some, like, fancy, you know, monuments that, uh, we can put down. Ooh, fencing. We could put fences. That might be cool. Could also put this down if we wanted to. Little monument, although, wasn't this like a plane built in like the 70s? Or is it like a 60s plane? I don't really know, to be honest. Uh, red star we could put down. I have fences. You know, I've never actually played with these. I've never actually played with these. Maybe we can do something with this. Can't build due to infrastructure. Ooh. What's the difference with these fences? 
What is that? Oh, it's like a little cart. Look at that. Ooh. That could be cool. Oh. Wow. Um, that might actually be cool to place down. Let's see. You know what? How about we do this? I, have actually, I haven't used these assets at all. Uh, fence and gate. You know what would be nice is if it was a closed gate. 40. Ah. Okay. I think this is... Uh, you know what? Yeah. How about we just do it this way? I haven't played with these fences at all, so might as well we do that. Watch this be like a million dollars to build. <laughs> it's the most expensive fence we have ever built in our lives. Um, a mill. Ooh, look at that. Um, no, I don't think we're going to do that. Windmill, a fence. Could we build like a Dutch windmill maybe? Uh, what is that? That's a 40. It'd be nice if I could fit this. It'd be real cool if I could fit this. Like, come on. Like, I can I can technically fit this. Why? Why does it do that? Okay, I, I mean, I can fit it, but it doesn't want to fit. Okay, fair enough. Fair enough. You don't want to fit, you don't want to fit. Oh my gosh. Game, can you not? Alright, can... Oh, why? Why, game? Alright, let's demolish this fence. Um, okay, so... Uh... Okay, can I, okay, can I build like a 20? Wow, that is a lot of scrap made from that one fence. What is in this scrap pile? <laughs> Why is the scrap pile so big? It's just a little fence. Calm down, game. Stop acting like the whole world is collapsing. Okay. Uh, let's add like a cart. I was thinking we could add like a cart here. It'd be like, uh, it'd be like this is like an old little farm spot. Um, there we go. There we go. Yeah, I like, I, you know, I kind of like that. I, I, I might remove that. Maybe we could make it like dirt instead, but I do kind of like that. A barn. Ooh, old barn. Windmills, fences. I think that's really all we have as far as the farming stuff goes. Um, I guess that, yeah, I think that's really it as far as farming goes. I guess we could like add like a little windmill. Nah, that's not going to fit in. Yeah, it's not going to fit in. That ain't going to fit in, man. Um, yeah, okay. It'd be nice if there was something else here, but unfortunately it doesn't seem there is. A little silo. Ooh. You know what would be cool is if I could connect that and it could... It, it'd be really cool if this could be connected, but it, yeah. Like, if they could actually walk through the fence, that'd be pretty neat. But unfortunately it doesn't seem like that's a thing. Uh, okay. What is... Is there a bus outside my house? Is that why that car... Uh -huh. Hold on. Sorry about that. Mateo's paranoia. It was, um, it was just a, um, you know, a, uh, what do you call it? A, um, it was a car. I thought it was a car reversing down the road, but it's not. So, there's a, there's an intersection outside my house. And, um, there's people that sometimes park, like, where I can see them. Um, uh, because my room that I'm recording in has a door. And then there's my bedroom, and there's a window right there. And sometimes cars like to park right where I can see them. They park in really weird places. And, uh, you know, it's a little weird. Like, why is somebody just parked on the side of the road? You know, I don't live in the city, nor do I, and I, it, excuse me. I don't live in the city, and I don't live in the suburbs. So, you know, it, it's a little weird that when somebody kind of just parks. And they always park right there. It's weird. I don't know. Anyways, enough with that jam rambling. Yeah, um, that looks kind of cool. It's like an old town. Anyways, that's going to do it for this episode. Oh my god. Um, yeah, that's terrible. Um, okay, that's that's bad. Um, whew, that's... Okay. That That's going to be the thumbnail for this episode. <laughs> uh, yeah, that, that's, that, that's not good. Yeah, okay. Um, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what's terrible? All these government loyalty problems. You can't see when things are burning down. Okay, so you know what this means? This means we gotta build ourselves a fire station real quick. <sighs> Let's build ourselves a quick fire station. I'll plop down the fire station. Um, do we even have a fire station in this town? Oh man, what was Mateo doing? All this time, Mateo thought, oh, he's playing it smart. No, he's not. Get real. Get real, guys. Come on, really? Mateo playing it smart? No. Um, where can I plop this down in a place that would make sense? Um, financially, ooh, we could build it right there. Let's just build it right here, shall we? Bam. Now, please say that the fire can last long enough that we can at least... It's gonna burn down. Yep, burn down. Rip. Rip. 
Ah, oh, please say this isn't expensive. Why are we losing money? What are we spending money on? What are we importing that's so expensive? My gosh, look at this. No! And we lost... Oh, we didn't lose any of that. Oh, that's good. How expensive is this? Okay, we'll use American dollars to build this. That's good. It looks like they don't lose their resources. Look at all those panels that we were losing. <laughs> that's a shame. Man, all those panels that we almost lost. Dang. Oh, that's what we were importing. We were importing resources to build the fire station. Okay, um, then I guess what we'll do is, can we buy American fire stations? Uh, or American fire stations. American fire vehicles. No, we can't. So let's go with this one. Uh, let's go with three of these Soviet vehicles. And if we could not pay for fuel, that'd be great. Please say I don't lose these resources. It's negative five degrees Celsius outside. Wow, it's cold. Okay, good. They don't lose anything. That's actually really, really good. Okay, um... So, yeah, okay. Okay, I gotta demolish this path real quick. So there's the bug in- oh my gosh. Uh, there's something in the game where if, if a building burns down and you rebuild it, the paths don't work on it. So you have to rebuild the paths too. Um, which is fine, I guess. Okay, well anyways, that's gonna do- that's gonna do it for this episode. Hopefully everybody enjoyed. Until next time, please rate, comment, and subscribe. See you later. Next episode, Mazikonum, Mazikonum, Mazikanum, and Daisy Monum are gonna get some attention. Yes, that's going to be in the next episode. Thank you for watching. Please write, comment, and subscribe. See you later. Peace.